A processor has 16 integer registers R0 to R15 and 64 floating point registers F0 to F16. It uses a 2 byte instruction format. There are 4 categories of instructions type 1 to 4. Type 1 consists of 4 instructions each with 3 integer register operand. Type 2 consists of 8 instructions each with 2 floating point register operands. Type 3 consists of 14 instructions each with 1 integer register operand and one floating point register operand. Type 4 consists of n instructions each with a floating point register operand. The maximum value of n is. So this is a question from computer organization. They are asking us about machine instructions. Let's take a look at how we can solve this. So in the question they have given us that it uses a 2 byte instruction format which meaning that the size of the instruction is 2 byte or 16 bits therefore the number of unique instructions it can have is 2 power 16. Now let's take a look at how much each type uses up. Now type 1 consists of 4 instructions each with 3 integer register operands. Now there are 16 integer registers therefore for representing each of the register we will need to use 4 bits out of the instruction and also there are 64 floating point registers therefore for representing each register we need 6 bits out of the instructions. So let's take a look at type 1. Type 1 consists of 4 instructions each with 3 integer register operands which meaning that total instructions will be 4 type 1 instructions into 2 power 4 each for each of the integer operands which we need to represent uniquely. Therefore it will be 2 power 4 into 2 power 4 into 2 power 4 into 4 instructions which is 2 power 14. Type 2 consists of 8 instructions each with 2 floating point register operands. That means the total number of instructions will be of type 2 will be 8 into 2 power 6 into 2 power 6. 2 power 6 because we need 6 bits for representing floating point register. That adds up to 2 power 15. Similarly type 3 is 14 instructions. It consists of 1 integer and one floating point register operand. So the total number of instructions will be 14 into 2 power 4 for the integer register and 2 power 6 for the floating point register which is 14 into 2 power 10. So let's see how many remaining instructions are there. Remaining instructions equal to 2 power 16 minus the sum of type 1, type 2 and type 3 instructions. Which when you solve we will see there is 2 power 11 instructions left. Now for type 4 instruction each instruction has only one floating point register operand and one floating point register operand needs six bits to represent. Therefore the number of type 4 instruction let us say it is n into 2 power 6. Now that will be equal to 2 power 11. Now we can solve for n easily here. We will see that n is 2 power 11 by 2 power 6 which is 2 power 5. The answer is 32.